turns out to be a gorgeous day today. stay out at Long Beach. So I just wanted to talk to you about something that kind of pissed me off. Heard about it the other day and you know the company Uber? They are a ride sharing service where basically the, the drivers are all self-employed and so they can use their own cars and work their own hours and they don't have to uh, basically be an employee of the company. Well, there was one certain, I guess they would be called subcontractor, who has his own uh, car obviously, has his CPL, and he was concealed carrying that day, and there was, I don't know if it was a man with a rifle or a handgun that, walked out in front of his car and started shooting into a crowd. Well, the Uber driver got out of his car and shot the guy. Stopped him from basically making a worse mass shooting or whatever happened. This was in Chicago, I believe. And uh, well, about a month, month and a half after that, Uber decided to respond by, <laughs> oh, it's just stupid. They said that you could not conceal carry, open carry, you could not carry a firearm in a vehicle as an Uber driver or someone riding an Uber. Well, how they could do this if they don't have any employees makes absolutely no sense to me because, I mean, come on, if you're gonna be working for them as your own subcontractor, you're gonna do whatever the hell you want. So, I mean, how this could be any sort of a rule doesn't really make sense. I mean, if I was an Uber driver, which I am not, I would still carry every day. I mean, it's part of my life. I'm not going to modify my life for a certain work situation. And, yeah, it's just, it's unbelievable, really. Well, I don't know, a couple days, maybe a week after Uber decided to say that they were a gun-free zone, a man with a rifle came and robbed an Uber driver. Is it weird, or does this just... I mean, events like this seem to always happen around you know, gun-free zones. Now who knows if it actually was directly related or not, but I mean, come on, it's pretty much bullshit. Now, I mean, it's, it's a company that's based in San Francisco, so there's probably some some people out there that are telling them, oh, I'm afraid there might be somebody carrying a gun. Their words are only going to do so much. If somebody's going to carry a gun, they're going to carry a gun, be it legally or not.
I just hope there's more people carrying legally than not. So what do you guys think about this whole Uber dilemma? Pisses me off.